at 7 a.m. tomorrow, Eastern Standard Time, I will be doing a live stream where I'll be doing my live reaction to the final chapter of Bleach. If you are wondering why I did not review the latest chapter of Bleach or react to it, some things came up that morning and I was unable to react to it. I did not have time to do a full-blown reaction. And secondly, honestly, I didn't have much to say on the chapter. If you do want me to review it, tell me in the comments that I will do a review. But, who knows, I, I don't have anything new to say on it. So, there was really no point in me making a review, I had nothing to say. But, tomorrow is the final chapter of Bleach. Because the rumor is that the chapters are coming out early tomorrow. So, unless the chapter does not come out tomorrow, I'll still live stream for like an hour in the morning. We can talk Bleach, Naruto, One Piece, I don't care. But, and I will still, I'll probably stream for like an hour tomorrow morning. I don't know, we'll cross that break when we get to it. But tomorrow will be the last chapter of Bleach. And just as I gave my prediction for the final chapter last week, I'll get them again this week. So, as I stated in my final chapter, final chapter prediction last time, we're probably going to see Ichigo and Orihime married. Maybe. A 1% chance he'd marry Rukia. I'm hoping that's what, that's what I want, but let's be honest here, it doesn't appear he's in Mistarate, he had not been talked about, so he's probably not in Mistarate or in the Soul Society, he's probably in the human world. There is the chance he's the new Soul King, we'll definitely find, probably find out what's up with the weird Rayasu. Maybe it's Yuha, maybe after the special announcement is, maybe the special announcement is Yuha is still alive. Because there was a chapter, I forgot which chapter, but Yuha said, in their, when they are at the happiest point in their lives, he will strike. So maybe now that they're in like 10 years of peace, they're done rebuilding, maybe now this is when he's gonna strike, that is possible, I don't know. Maybe he went out way too easily. Made a big announcement that Bleak will continue in another magazine. That is very possible, I, but I'm not sure it has happened before. I think Fairy Tale, I think Fairy Tale used to be a shonen, but it went to another magazine. I could be wrong. Tell me, if, tell me if I'm wrong about that in the comments. But no, but I just, I'm sitting here and I'm looking at Bleach and I'm just thinking, is it it? Is it it? So we're probably going to get the pairing, which is probably going to be Ichigo to Rahime. They'll probably be thrown in there. And there is a pairing. Maybe Ichigo will just end up by, all by his lonesome by himself. Who knows? I mean, Ichigo seems like the kind of character. He doesn't really need a girl in his life. He doesn't really seem like he needs a woman. He seems like he would be more concerned with having a friend than having a woman. I've, I've always thought like he'd be more concerned with getting a friend than getting a girlfriend. I've always figured he doesn't really care. I mean, he's never so too. He's shown to be a teenage boy, so he gets like awkward around women in certain situations, and like he definitely is attracted to them, but he's never been shown to have an interest in like dating. It's not like we're like Naruto, where straight off the bat, and like chapter three, he was like, Sakura's hot. Like, Sakura's cute. I'm, I'm, like, this is the I, I do give a shit about this kind of stuff. There's never been any reference to Ichigo caring about that kind of thing. So we're probably not going to be a pairing. We're honestly going to find out who you Soul King is. I'm, a, I'm an Aizen believer. If the series is going to end next week, it's going to probably be Aizen, most likely. I think that makes the most sense. You know that when he was absorbed by Nuha, he like retook over and using Mahokyoku, he like absorbed that part of a Soul King or some shit like that. I mean, that's the most common theory now, what I think makes the most sense. But, I mean, I'm, I'm trying to think, what else is there really to address? Maybe, maybe we'll address what happened to Chad. Because last time I checked, Chad was fighting an army of undead soldiers. So, yeah, maybe, or maybe Chad is still there, in the bond, in the soul palette, fighting an army of undead soldiers. They will cut the Chad, he'll be like a, he'll have like a long gray beard like Gandalf or Dumbledore, and he'll be like fighting off this like army of soldiers. That would be awesome, it would be hilarious. We'll probably see what happens to Uriu. Well, we'll see what happens to Ichigo's sister. Maybe we'll see Kanin as a, Karin as a Shinigami or a Soul Reaper. I know it's a pretty popular theory people have of something she would do later on in life, become a soul reaper because she's always had a talent for using her spiritual pressure. I mean, it's possible, not likely, but possible. 
I always thought that Norma career to your pick when she died. But that's beside the point. The point is, is that we're going to find out what happens to all the characters of the Mishuming world. We're going to find out what's going on with Yuha. We're going to find out what happened with Yuha, what happened with Aizen, and what happened with Ichigo. And the series is probably going to end, and I guarantee you, it's just going to be a black and white page. And if I sound kind of sad, it's going to kind of end. Maybe this is it. I mean, this, there is no if, maybe, or but. I knew there had been a rumor last week. There was that rumor that there was more bleach. But now we, we now we know. This is it. Unless this is like the ultimate troll by Kubo. This is the end. A bleach. And it's not the ending it deserved. This is a theory that at one point we're giving Naruto and One Piece a run for their money. This is a theory that deserves the better than this. So it's very sad to see it go. I'm not going to complain though about it, about how, about myself and my situation. I mean, I feel truly bad for people like James Hansen, who clearly love this theory. Who clearly just, they love it. Like, it actually holds up, but, the Bleach holds a place in my heart. I care about Bleach. But it had not impacted, it hadn't really impacted my life. It more than just a theory that I really enjoyed and got up and read every week. But it hadn't really impacted my life, my life the way like One Piece, Dragon Ball, and Naruto had. I, it never, it never really changed anything about my life. It didn't really give me any new opportunities. It was kind of, it just, it's a bad act one to me. It's just a really bad act anime that I can put my feet up and watch. It's not the one I'll be critical of. It's not the one I'll think too much about. It's just the good one. And the one that I can really enjoy. So, yeah. I mean, at this point, the only thing I think that's really left to discuss is what the special announcement is. I'm leaning more towards uh, a new anime. Which is still very unlikely. Uh, some people were saying it'll be something stupid, like a line of skirt. Oh god, this is a t- they make a new line of skirt, and all the skirts will say a uh, skirt ritter on it or some shit like that. But there are really two theories that people really care about: more blue, uh, a new anime or a continuation of the manga in another magazine. Honestly, the new manga is. I guess it's possible if Kubo wants to do that, but you have to realize the end of this arc has already been so bad. And that's to like continue the Thousand Year Blood War arc from wherever he leads it off next chapter. And then he's like, no, the arc never ended, and that was just a really bad point in the arc that we can just blame on Stone and Jump. But I mean, I don't really know what else to really say about it. I mean, maybe it's a new anime, maybe it's a continuation in another magazine. I don't know. I'm ho- I'm hoping at least that it's an anime. It definitely, I can almost guarantee it's not going to be a movie. It just wouldn't make sense for them to. Jordan Jump is not going to invest in a movie. They're just not going to do that. So, but maybe an anime, maybe. Mm, that's the best. That's the most. I knew an anime is the most likely thing. The, the thing I'm hoping for that is a manga, and maybe um, we'll get the anime back anyway eventually, but the thing I'm hoping for is a manga. I mean, I'm not sure though, it's, it's really sad. So remember, tomorrow at 7 a.m. Eastern Standard Time, if you want to read the final chapter with a bleach with me, you can. I know you probably don't want to, be attacking and James Hansen are probably going to be streaming, which I, I'm not to join my stream super early. Because I want to be there in time for their streams whenever they do them. But, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed my little ramble of talking about the Final Chapter of Bleach for a second time. Hope you guys enjoyed. Please like, comment, and subscribe for more videos. And One Big Nation, signing out. Hey.